hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel for those who are returning subscribers thank you guys so much for your support for sticking around for sharing my content for commenting and for just being great and for those who are watching my video for the first time thank you thank you guys for clicking on to my video please just click on the red subscribe button and just be part of this family all right cool let's just get straight into today's video i just wanted to come on here just to encourage you guys to practice gratitude you know when the word of god says that we are the product of our words we are the product of what we speak it says that life and death lies in your tongue your tongue has so much power it can either break or make your life your career and everything else in your life your relationships absolutely everything so what do you speak into your life what do you speak into your children's lives what do you speak into your husband's life what do you speak into your career what do you speak into um absolutely anything that you really are striving to achieve um my life started taking a different turn when i started speaking positive words when i started believing in myself and believing even in my failures you know because there's there's one thing about um just being knocked down by life you know that the only way is upwards literally there's no down down you know when you are at your lowest point of life the only way and the only point it is upwards but you're not just going to move in the next level of your life by simply not doing anything you know you need to get up you need to show up you need to speak and you need to envision whatever that you want to achieve so so important guys that whatever that we speak does not contradict where we are going if you were to call the HPCSA and ask them about me, I'm probably not even recognized yet, you know, because I'm so busy with my masters. But I don't look at myself as a person who's not qualified as yet. Yes, that is my reality, but that is not what I see. I know very well that for as long as I speak it, for as long as I envision it, for as long as I work towards that, there's nothing that will stop me from achieving that goal. You cannot sow grapes and harvest apples. It just doesn't work. So you reap what you sow. It sounds so cliche. We hear it all the time. We hear it in church. We hear it in the streets. We hear it everywhere. But that is the reality of life. You will not sow laziness and reap success. It does not work like that. So I just wanted to come on here and encourage you guys that, you know what? Your reality might be the opposite of where you envision yourself and that is okay that's okay the only thing that you need to do is to make sure that you get up you show up you work hard and you envision yourself also surround yourself with people who understand your goal who understand your dreams and who can align with them because it it really defeats the purpose if you are going to envision your life at greater heights and yet you still hang around people who always drag you down literally just tell you you cannot achieve that that is impossible you cannot work and study at the same time you cut 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 you can do absolutely anything that you put your mind to the only destruction the only hindrance in your life is yourself so mind how you speak to yourself. Just mind your tongue. Are you speaking positive words into your life, into your future, into your career, into your family, into your children, into your um, relationship? You cannot speak death and expect life in 
any aspect of our lives you know so it's so so important that each and every day we practice how to be positive how to speak positive words into our own lives you know um a whole lot of people have been dming me asking me but how how do you deal with people who tell you that you will not amount to anything it's something that brene brown once said in her interview with oprah, uh, mama O, you know oprah winfrey and she says that you know what you cannot listen to people who are not in the arena people who are not getting their their hands dirty you cannot take any advice from those people they are not doing anything with their lives so the only way that they can distract you is to tell you that that is not gonna work that idea is stupid that idea is not gonna come to pass nobody's gonna buy it because they are absolutely not doing anything with their lives but you cannot listen to people who are not in the arena people who are not getting their hands dirty people who are not doing anything with their lives so it's very important that you guard your heart with diligence because that is where life stops and how do you do that you do it by making sure that the people around you understand your vision they understand where you're going you do not entertain negative types you do not entertain gossip you do not have to be around people who are negative you don't have to be around people who don't believe in you step up for yourself step out of those companies and those people and stand alone you know even if it means that for you to get to where god wants you to be you need to be alone so be it one thing that i i was even telling someone yesterday that you know what if god has said to you that you can go ahead with that idea with that youtube channel with um that um career with that relationship who cares what anybody says who cares literally who cares if the master of the whole universe has given you a go ahead what more do you want you know he will make sure that he supplies you with all the resources that you need so yeah guys um i just wanted to come on here and just encourage you guys that you know what pick up that bait it is not yet over until god says it's over so yes guys i hope that you have enjoyed this video i hope that you will introspect you will take time step back look at your life and start making changes so yes guys i hope that you will like this video subscribe comment down below and tell me what you think let's engage in the comment section and thank you thank you thank you so much for your support for recommending my videos for sharing my link thank you so much i really really appreciate it i pray that god will bless each and everyone watching this video thank you so much guys until we meet in my next video goodbye